Hello guys, KP Shamino here with another guide for the brook trout. No, no, I'm just joking for the unique lake trout. And uh, you already saw me catching him, so it was not a really big fight. Yeah, not a big fight. It was a cool fight, I think. The, the setup is very heavy, so it was a really good fight. And it's a very beautiful fish. It's one of my favorite fish. So uh, if you check him, he's so enormous, this, uh, this fish. So in this guide, I'm going to show you guys how you need to catch a unique lake trout. And if you don't catch a unique lake trout, you're always going to have trophy lake trouts. So with this lure, the medium spoon 56G60, you only get trophies and uniques. And that's why I want to uh, remake my video because my previous video is still uh, before the patch. So uh, that's what we are going to do. So uh, let's keep this fellow. Uh, okay, I'm in Alberta. For the guys that don't know, this is Alberta. Not a lot of people are fishing here. It's a pity because it's a very beautiful lake, but I can understand it. The experience and reward is not that high. So, you still one peg. I hope in uh, this and a couple of weeks we got more stuff from Alberta. Fingers crossed for the new release. So, uh, yeah, you just need to go here to Fisherman's Hut. You go fishing and then you come here on the wooden dock. And you just go here to the left. And the position that you can get the unique lake trout is from this side. So here you got like a corridor. I think a river comes from there here in the lake. Until here at the tree. So you got a lot of distance. If you throw uh, on that position between those two points. You got a chance to get the unique lake trout. So I most of the time I just throw here in the middle. It doesn't matter a lot I think. If you go a little bit more to the right. It's going to be a lot deeper. You see it on the time that your lure needs to get to the bottom. Therefore I always throw here. And what you need to do is trout eyesight they got very good eyesight so you need to be patient don't go like use some bolt on the retrieve just go with the three speed stop and go but do it very slow so what i do the whole time is i just let my lure stop so you just reel and you stop you just reel and you stop very patient don't go too fast and that's how you're going to catch the most fish. This is a snack point. 40 meters is a snack point. Just reel a little bit. Unsnack your medium spoon. And you just go again. I go to 20 meters and then I stop. I never got like unique closer to the shore than that. I don't think that they're sitting that close. So 20 meters and then you go again. So yeah, here is another snack point. Two snack points, 40 meters and 28 meters normally. Okay, 20 meters. Then I just reel in. So that was the position, how you need to throw. And uh, why I'm using the medium spoon too, because the medium spoon is one of the lures that you can throw the farthest. So you need to go with the casting setup. It's possible that the spinning rod works too, but uh, I think you are going to get spooled because the other day I was fishing with the casting setup and uh, I had only my 9 kilogram test line on and I just needed to do alt F4 after some time. So it's possible with the spinning rod, but just go with these guys. It's going to save your life. Uh, yeah, because sometimes you're going to get spooled on the spinning rod. I'm almost sure of it because the unique lake trout is a very strong fish. And therefore, I'm going with the medium spoon. Otherwise, I cannot make the distance. There is something very funny about the medium spoon. It throws, yeah, a lot further than the other stuff. And I think even if you go... I'm now using the 56G. And I even think if you go with the 42G, that that throws further than the 50C, 56G. So that's really strange. But yeah, it's how it is. It's a game, you know. And sometimes there are a little bit strange things in it compared how you would think it will work. But yeah, that's how it is. So Galaxy Cast 260, Vortex 7000, Mono 0.5. So that is the highest setup that I can have. Medium Spoon 56 gram and 60 hook. And that's how you need to do it. So it's not, uh, yeah, I would say complicated because you just need to use the highest test setup possible in the game. But this is very important. You guys will see it in my net. So I got two fish today. 
a trophy lake trout and a unique lake trout and but yesterday it was a sunny day and then the time frame is three hours and i got i think six or seven trophy lake trouts after each other like i said with this lure it's only trophies and uniques so you see it here only 19 gold uh, that you get for it the experience isn't that big either but we already know that for a long time in alberta so that's how it is for the time frames uh, you got uh, you got sunny from 4 to 7 and then you got snowy cloudy that's from 8 to 10 but you got another weather type here too let's have a look you got uh, this type too cloudy i try to fish in it uh, and i think this is 12 so i try 10 to 11 am and i got a trophy in that hour too so maybe you can get the unique in it but i cannot confirm it because i don't have the unique in it but i probably think if you want to get unique on a cloudy day yeah fish in that time zone here this is noon by the way so most of the uniques now are perfectly in the graph uh, when the, the it's the best time of the day so that's how it is guys so thanks for watching the video guys i hope that you can get the unique lake trout have fun and see you guys in the next video bye bye